tennis fans, welcome to Outside the Ball. These are not your ordinary tennis interviews. This month, we've been breakdancing with Anna Ivanovic, karaoke with Grigor Dimitrov, golfing with Novak Djokovic, and much, much more. Get ready to go behind the scenes and beyond the game. You're watching Outside the Ball. Tennis players are used to being in the spotlight, jet-setting the world, and hobnobbing with the rich and famous. So who do the pros get starstruck over? I love Kanye West, Drake, he's my Canadian homeboy. Uh, I like Gerard Butler. Gerard Butler! Oh, yeah. And Richard Gary also, because I love to watch uh, Pretty Woman. <laughs> it's a long time ago, they made a movie, but it's amazing. If you had to pick a favorite boy band, <laughs> what would it be? I'll give you some options. Okay. Backstreet, Sync, or 1D? I go Backstreet Boys. Do you have a favorite song? Uh, the call. I'm a very bad singer. <laughs> I still don't know the song. Come on, run. There's the word. Okay, I'll just dance. Me and the boys went out just to end the misery. And then I don't know after what's going on, so I have to go with the flow. <laughs> And it seems the stars are just as fascinated with tennis as we are. Do you plan on playing Wimbledon or anything in the future? Or is it like, what are your tennis goals? I don't know. If Venus or Serena needed a partner, like a shorter, fatter white girl, as a doubles partner, okay. I would be there. He's gonna serve an actual ball for us, John Lovitz. What's what's the miles per hour on your serve? I just served it. Did you see it? Can you give me a number? That was about 780. You didn't even see it, did you? 780. Will Ferrell was the one that was uh, leading us on the court. He was the one that won us the match. I mean, Novak was lazy out there. Look, who am I to say? I'm not a professional tennis player, but he's definitely overrated. <laughs> Number one in the world here, Will Ferrell. <laughs> Both celebrities and pro athletes lead glamorous lives. Player parties are the hottest red carpet events in the tennis world, and we got an invite from Dominika Sivilkova. Thank you for having us. We're gonna get a look at what goes into the night, what kind of makeup, what outfit, and then we're gonna get ready and go. This looks good. Yeah. That's pretty good. Yeah. What do you think? I love it. It's we're ready. style. <laughs> oh, okay, a limo. This yeah, time we wore my limo. limo How perfect. Yeah, that's Thank great. You. Going to a player party with a pro tennis player means you won't have any trouble getting in. A big thanks to Dami for bringing us along. What happens when Jack Sock and John Isner trade in their tennis rackets for golf clubs? We decided to tag along and find out. We thought we'd do a little putting challenge. How do you feel about that? Uh, it's my domain. Uh, I don't think Jack has, uh, has any chance here. I think we both know who has the better touch between the both of us. <laughs> oh, that's a good putt. You all know who has better touch here. Oh yeah. my gosh. Oh wow. He was going left, I just didn't play enough. Yeah, this is oh. horrible. <laughs> Alright, I think we should swap out golf balls for tennis balls. What do you say? Yes. Let's do Good that. job guys. We'll call it a tie. Just down the fairway, Novak Djokovic and coach Boris Becker geared up for a friendly round. Let's see how Novak and his team fared on the green. Oh. <laughs> I get to be safe. He's a kind of guy that likes beach a lot, so he's going to spend some time on the sand. I spent more time on the beach than David Hasselhoff. <laughs> sorry guys for this very poor Sorry, performance. sorry. Next time. Well, you can't be good at everything. Another popular sport among tennis players is football or soccer, and they take it very seriously. Football is such an emotional sport, okay. so we're gonna do a little segment called the Faces of Football. Here we go, so we're, we're watching the match right okay. there, right? Okay. And the game, it's tied, and one of your players is about to take a penalty kick, and we're watching, how do we react? We're like, <gasps> Your favorite player just got thrown out on a red card. What do you do? Oh! They shoot, they score, they win the World Cup! <laughs> we love celebrating tennis players and we even make music videos about them. You're my favorite, so play me, baby. Well, we've done it again and this time has combined a few of our favorite things. Today's an awesome day! Anna Ivanovich, sweet dance moves, and a catchy tune. 
Cause Anne is gonna play. Mm -hmm. We dare you to not play. sing or dance along. Mm -hmm. And she keeps moving. What did you think of the dance moves? They're fun. They're fun, actually. It, I think I could be even able to do some of these. The no. robot? Can you do no, the robot? I can you do? If I do, it starts the wave. Can you finish it? <laughs> I'm not sure. I that think was I have no reason. That was no good. Reason. That was so. It was like we were connected. Wait, watch this. <laughs> guys thank you for making such a nice video for me i loved and i really enjoy watching it see you soon on outside the ball we've got exclusive access to top tennis players and are bringing you fresh fun videos every tennis tuesday so check in each week at outsidetheball.com thanks for watching outside the ball bye